Hello, hello guys. In this video, we're going to see how to put the marks or the scores of student of 100 all over the marks of your choice. Maybe you are a teacher or you are ju just an educator or you just have a team that you are just assessing and in time you just want to put the score of different assessments of 100 or over n marks or over the marks of your choice. Here you can see you have chemistry uh, subject and you have just a quiz 1, quiz 2 up to quiz 7. Here I just I, I may just have a different different assessment and at the end of the term I just want to put the score all the marks of all assessments of all the quizzes over 100 or I can just notice that the subject chemistry is a uh, uh, the student report is on 40 marks 40 points. How can I do it simply in Microsoft Excel? It is very easy. First of all, you need to calculate the total. You can see the first quiz is over 50, the second over 40, 75, and here the total of all assessment, of the max of all assessment is three, uh, uh, 397. And this is the total, the total max. This is the total max. Uh, that uh, the student just worked over and here there are the, the, the scores that just uh, my student obtained in all quizzes, in all assessments that I give them in chemistry. And I may just have here score or I can just, I may just draw this table, the table of this kind before just assessing. I can even just delete everything here. I can just create here data, I can create this data, I can create this content, and I only put formula here, and I just want this uh, to, to tutorize, and this is at the beginning of the term, and I think I'm just going to, to give the seven assessment in the whole term, and I just want to count it over this total, and I will just need to have uh, the total score here of 100, and here of 40. And I may have the score here. Uh, this one have a minute. I can just also delete. Can just create content. And here, here uh, and here you see I can just uh, I, may, I can just have uh, an empty, uh, empty table. And it's drawn this way. So that whatever I type here will be added to here to this total over this total and will be immediate report on over 100 or and here also it will be immediate report over 40 and at the end of the term once in time I'm just going to go to make a student report I will only copy this column where you have the total score of uh, 40 and let me just here control Z to have the the score that I had yeah, this is the max that I had before and here I just want to tutorize I just want to put the formula here and here put the formula of the sum you can just add one by one or you can just type sum you can type sum and just you select from here to here and you cross parentheses this is some function there are many videos that I've just done about the formulas in Excel and here I can scroll down to copy the formula or I can double click to copy the formula. You can see you have the, for, uh, the total of all the marks and this is over one uh, over 397. And here I just want to put my here the the marks the, the score of, of my student over 100 here and how to do this how to put the score of the total score of 100 maybe i just want to count the percentages what i have to do here is to put a formula here that will put the total the the, the total in this quorum of 100 what i have to do here is to take the student score 
a student score here I just put equal sign and I just take the marks of here in J5 I don't I don't need to type 170 I don't have, I just don't want I don't need to to type 170 even if I can do it but I just want to to put a reference so that I can copy my formula down and I take this score these marks of and I just I multiply this uh, by 100 by 100 you take the total the total marks or the total points of students times 100 because we just want to to keep this the, the max here of 100 or over the total the total score the total marks here of uh, 397 i hope you get it and here hit enter this is what i get i can even put this of one over 200 it's only require here it only uh requires to to here to type the marks that you want to put you just uh, i'll take the total um, student marks and you just uh multiply by the, the the marks here you want and here you divide the total score the total marks the total marks of uh, of the of all quizzes of all assessments and here you hit enter and here you see I get 42, here I just get 42.8. I can even just remove the decimals. I can decrease decimals. I can just here, can just decrease this day. The decimals here can just uh, select and just go up here, decrease decimals. Let me just select. You can see here you have... Uh, I have copied the formula here and here I just need to copy the I just need to decrease decimals here I can select and go here and decrease decimals you see in time I just type here I'm decreasing decimals and you can see now what I have here let me center my marks here and guys you see I have the score here all over 100 and this is done the same way as I can just do it over 40. I can here even put the formula here that put all the total score here over 40 because this is the the this is the max the max that I just want to have on my student report and have to do it the same way. I just here put equal sign. And I just click on the total students, uh, the total marks of student, the total score of student. In the previous, uh, in the previous column here, I have just multiplied by one hundred. But now, just now, if you just have understood, if you just uh, have understood this one, uh, here just need to multiply by forty. Now times. times 40 or over 307 and then I hit enter you see what I get this is the score or this is the max of student the max of student or of, uh, of 40 and here you can double click here to copy the formula down you can see the formula here is copied down and I can just uh, click here to decrease decimals I can here decrease uh, decimals up to the last one and I can just center this one let me uh, let me center here and now we see what I get this is the max of my student over 40 I can just take this uh, yeah I can just take the score of my student now over 40 and I just uh, can just uh, copy this in my student report maybe I'm just using uh, best grade to make reports and this is very easy guys now you see it now I have my total I can just found format if I want I can make it the same format as uh, the other school here that I have you can see here once I can just uh, again decrease this mouse 
can decrease this mouse again. You can see what I have here. And this is fine. And guys, you can see you can put the uh, total max of each student or the or the assessment uh, max or the assessment power went or over the the max of your choice over 40 over 50 over 60 you can just do whatever you want guys as i just think that, that this video is just helping and you can see here all i have now i can just have this one or you can just do this at the end or you can just remove here the all this the score that i have here can remove and i just left uh, left the formula there let me just create content you can see remember that here I have the formula the formula that is here is the total the sum of all assessment the, the sum of all quizzes of my student you can see it is the one that is here and what i have here is the formula of my just a of all student or over 100 and you can see and here it is all over 40 and whatever i type here whatever i type here maybe this one is blank if i put here uh 56 you can see immediately uh, uh, the formula will be applied you can see what i have here this is here the total is 56 1 over 100 is 40, over 40 is 6. You can see. If I put another max here, maybe she, this one called 36, you can see the formula also applied. Here there is the total, here there is over 100, here there is, it is over 9. It is made at report itself over 100 or, and over uh, 40, and I can here put the number that I want. And this, you see this, I make it, I uh, can just make it automatic. Automatic. And this is, uh, this is very nice. If you are, uh, anytime, uh, if you are a teacher, it is very helping. And whatever you type here, maybe this one, you get uh, uh, 53 in this quiz. You can see here it is automatic. 12. And here maybe uh, 61. You can see 22 over 40 it is automatic all those columns here are left the formulary and i leave this one blank so that any quiz that i give to my students i'll just a copy uh just a, a here type the marks and here to be the tutorize and this one day of 100 and at the end of the term i'll just a copy this quorum over 40 all i just take this one over 100 if i just want to rank my student guys i hope you enjoyed this video and I hope this is well helping and uh, let me just uh, say bye and see you next time.